Hi guys, it's Jay here again, and I wanted to show off my new IO Bridge project. Probably the first IO Bridge controlled weapon of war. I've got a little coil gun here. Uh, I'll show more about that later. Uh, but what's really neat to me is that I'm using the Wiimote here to control the IO Bridge servo. Uh, I've got a script here that pulls the Wiimote data, and then I have a web page that I've written. Uh, you can see right now everything's in cent at the center position. And the web page uh, uses the IO Bridge widgets to control the servo output. I got a servo breakout board here. So if you see, when I move the Wiimote, it moves uh, right, uh, as the shooter would be, and it moves in response. So I'm kind of pulling periodically here and just taking a somewhat finite granularity. But uh, I can control that there. I will hook up the trigger to uh, a relay when I get that board and I can fire but uh, for now it's unplugged for safety uh, sake. So I'm going to take this to the floor show you a little coil gun in action. Okay uh, I'm out here down here at the shooting range for safety's sake still have my IO bridge module, my Wiimote and uh, I've got a big thick book to aim at uh, we're loaded here one in the, one in the chamber and there's a little manual switch. I'm plugged in the wall power right now. And touche, it fires. Uh, what I'm using here as a as a coil gun is uh, actually the ball return from a golf putter that I had. Um, and as you can see, it, it's got a little bit of a electromagnetic power there to, to fire a projectile. One last time into the breach. And uh, like I said, later, you know, when I can sneak this into my buddy's house, somewhere far away I'll, I'll put in a remote trigger but for now uh, I think that fires pretty well you can see it bounce right off uh, so that's the Wiimote hacking I hope you guys like it and uh, see you later with another project